What's up everyone and welcome to another Yodo Link's video. So we have a new character in it is a Link Brains character, one of the members of the Knights of Hanoi, Spectre. There he is. So Spectre can be unlocked on the 26th of May at 1pm after we fill the conditions of 2.5 million points at the Cumulative Reward System at that uh, sort of time. But what his, what his uh, main card is, we do not know yet. But what we can see is the two event exclusive cards, Sun Valentrius and Sun Valentrius. So these two are plot link monsters. There have not been a plot link monster yet in the inventory. So this is going to be a first for us. So let's check out what the effects are. Link 1, level 4 level plot type monster. Link summon on the extra deck using a Sun Sea Genius Lochi. Add the Sun Vine spell or trap from your attack to hand. This card can be targeted for attacks, but your opponent can still attack you directly. However, any bell or effect damage that you can that you will be taking once per turn, gain that amount of life points instead. Then if you do special summon one Sun Vine monster from your extra deck. So that's a pretty good combo overall. So if your opponent if your opponent attacks you attacks you and it's the first time, you gain life points and special summon a monster instead. However, the second time if your opponent attacks this monster, you'll be taking battle damage instead. So the first time round is gonna be an interesting round to see. But enough of that. Well, let's talk about combos after we get the card and the character as a playable du duelist. Next up is Sun Velum Elias. Two plus plant type monsters, including a Link monster. If this card's Link summons, Spiral summon the Sun Seed Genius Lochi from your graveyard. Oh, what is this? Sun Seed Genius Lochi is basically the. I guess it's gonna be the Genex controller for, for this archetype overall. So yeah, can be, can be targeted for attack and once per turn. Target a Sun Vine Link monster you control, this card points to attack a number of times each battle phase up to the number of Sun Vine Link monsters you currently control. So if you have approximately, let's say, um, including this card, 3 Link monsters on the Sun Vine Link monsters on the field, so we'll be attacking 3 times. So we better hope that the other Sun Vine or Sun Vine monsters that we'll be getting from an upcoming mini boss or a main boss will fulfill the conditions for us to actually build this deck. But anyways, another word of exciting news, the Road to Worlds campaign on the 24th of May, we will be getting a firewall dark drag a firewall dragon dark fluid look at that link five a link five monster y'all if this card is link summon place a counter on this card equal number of different types of cybers monsters in your graveyard ritual fusion sacro xc's this card gains 2500 attack for each and each counter on it during the battle phase only when your opponent activates a monster effect remove counter negate the activation this effect was activated between this card's attack declaration and the at end at the end of the damage step. This can make another attack in a single row. So let's say if your opponent was either activate something like a wall disruption. Uh wait, 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 wait. This card's declaration. Yeah, something when this card's about to attack, your opponent activates something, you can make another attack. Or if you're after you attack, your opponent activates something after the after that attack then it can make another attack. Alright, oh, that's a that's a good way to confirm it overall. And look at that, I love the artwork for, for Dark Fluid, it looks so good. And it's ghost it's kinda of got ghost rarity prismatic rare by the way. Not to mention you will be get, we will all be getting a skill, Dark Fluid Link, Playmaker and I. 500 gems, one character unlock ticket and one skill ticket to boot. Oh, oh, oh look at that. But let's check out the event, um, EX, Cartridge EX over here, so let's see, Sun Valent Dryas cannot be obtained by the event rules, but Sun Valent Malayas can. So if you have yet to obtain your Sun Valent Malayas, then this is your other way to obtain it, aside it from the Kilter Reward System. Either way, you stand a chance to obtain more than 2 copies if you are able. So for the for the tag tournament, I obtained about 5 copies of Sky Dragon Armor Shell along with Let's say uh, 4 copies of Fiery Blaze, so that title event is pretty much done, and I'm actually quite happy with it. But anyways, let's go into a duel with Spectre himself. Let's see what this guy has got. So as per usual, when it comes to raid boss duels, you will do extra damage if you're using Link Monsters, as based on the world that the raid boss is in. So if you're in the Link Frames world, if you use Link Monsters, you'll be doing more damage during that turn. Kill the reward system is also up for grabs as well. So you gotta remember 2.6 million to unlock Spectre as a playable duelist. And aside from that, the damage ranking system is here as well. So the card pack is mostly um, Link Range monsters as you can see. Salamangrid, Borolode, Trick Stars, Dino Wrestlers, Alter Guys, and some other miscellaneous cards over here. If you have yet to obtain any of these cards, then you can basically hope that when you get the damage done. And also for the card pack, let's just hope that you get as much as you can as well. So let's go into our first duel with us with our good old friend Spectre. Well, this is actually my fifth duel, so mm, yeah, I guess. Wait. 
What? Nani? Eh? 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 Let me double check my deck first. Uh, sorry about that. My name is what did this is this? Hey, what did I set for this? Did, did, what did I set for this? Is this my Orcus deck? Oh, it's my Cypress Magician deck. Okay, well, that's my basically not properly built, so let's just stick to Playmaker and I deck. So, anyways, uh, back to the topic. Let's duel against Spectre and let's see how he does. So assist duels are an easy and cheap way for you to participate in the raid puzzle to increase your kill table reward system, points, and then get the rewards later on. So do as much damage as you can. So let's see how it looks from here. Hello there. And not a good starting hand, but okay, I guess. We'll go to Link 2, that's for sure. Ah! No, the debuffs are back. Let's see, uh, okay, back of secretary, alright, back of secretary, let's go, I'm getting all the spell, all my spell cards except cards, this early in the game, that's great, mm -hmm. I have yet to update this deck, I think I was actually trying, this deck, this deck that I built is just, uh, oh, sun seeds, okay, Link streamer. Oh, baby. Okay. One and two. Buckle my shoe. Up the jammer. All right. Special summon my token onto the field. And then now we'll just go into firewall dragon on the dot. I really need to update this deck. Holy crap! Look at that. It took me two turns to bring out a proper link monster. Update Gemma's effect activates, so we can go for double attacks this time round. One. Two. Look at that. This losing screen is essentially him looking up. So if you remember, most of the time if you do against other characters, they are facing you or facing to the side. So this is actually a new addition that I'm actually liking quite a lot. So something different, yeah, you know you know what I mean? Alright, so yeah. So if you're if you're quite surprised, um so the early stages of the raid boss duel, Spectre's gonna be very low leveled in the initial parts, but later on when his level does get higher, then you will start crying essentially because that's when he actually link summons and actually does real damage to you during those times. But other than that, if you have a proper link deck that actually does a lot of damage like the altar guys or Salaman Greats, or even the proper rocket deck. Then I guess you can essentially do a lot of damage for this raid boss tool and not do poorly as what I did just now. Because if you look at this deck, I don't think I actually updated this deck. I actually focus on the magician's deck overall. Oh my goodness, I get I have three one-time passcodes and I'm actually only using one copy. And I didn't even join the sign net mining, so I don't understand what just happened, but okay, I guess. But overall, I am gonna improve this deck. You can bet on that and we'll do much more damage later on. And that, that's all for the video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Goodbye, have a great day and keep dueling.